Before we get in the video, please like, make sure to subscribe, turn on your notifications, go ahead and leave a comment below. And click on the how you can help, which brings up the Family for the Game website and gives you lots of ideas how you can help us. Thank you. I'm on Peter here from Family for the Gaming and I'm joined by Team Gamer and we're going to be playing some N NBA 2K21 on the PS4. This is going to be a game or two, I haven't touched the game. Well, yeah, I've, I played one during a week at uh, school night and then last night. So, I've been playing only two matches. I've also played as the U.S. team in this in the NBA. You know that there was a U.S. team either. Part of the Olympics. Mm. Okay, play now. current classic in all times. Yeah. Yep. Alright. I'm playing GSW. Uh. Hmm. Pacers. Pistons or Blazers? Or Pelican or Pelicans? Blazers. Where are the Blazers? I remember seeing them for sure. Portland Trail Blazers, you got it ready up. Oh yeah, are you ready up? Ah yes, we do need to change that. Change we forgot, what? We forgot to turn that off with Nightbot, since it's now October. Yeah. Eh, we'll get that. So, I mean, you can... Just hit options, just go. Just pause, just pause, just spam pause, it's fine. So is everyone ready for some NBA 2K21? The Trailblazers focused as they walk into the locker oh. room earlier on. Their job is basic tonight. Get a win on their home court. I don't know the Trailblazers play. Oregon. This is the backdrop for our broadcast setting tonight. Well, it's the NBA on 2K Sports. Welcome everyone to the broadcast table. Chris Webber. Yeah, I mean, look. Kevin, thanks very much. CJ McCollum has talked about the bond you mean the actual the place Portland, Portland. Blazers team he said the connection comes so they're not the from the United isolated States isolated in the Pacific Northwest far from the rest of the world basketball is the only make Portland is indeed yeah, is one of the awesome. great cities yeah. in the NBA Dave, hey thank you. stop it terrific talented backcourts tonight great did you ever people add anything for you playing by that. across another yeah, top level guard Listen, it raises the stakes, yeah, no doubt whatever. about it. You, you always want the opportunity to play against the best because so you want to see where you stand. But in the oh. end, even oh, though you know a guy's better than you, and you're going to have that be the case a lot of nights, you still know that I think it's one, it, one of these few buttons to hit it. Comes to win it. And, and that's where you have to keep your focus. Okay, yeah, and now the Golden State go. Warriors starters. Yep. Curry and Clay, the Splash Brothers, in the backcourt. Draymond yeah, Green is out I, there I with Wiggins, right now. and it's Chris in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. And for the Trailblazers, pairing up in the backcourt, Lillard and McCollum. Nurkic oh, no, is out Curry. there with Anthony, and it's yeah. Reason in at the three, the small forward. Thompson is double, kicks it out to Wiggins. Plenty of space, ah. misses off the right iron. 
This, this game, I have not played, and and don't tell, tell me in Twitch chat that I'm a bot because I haven't played this game for like a year. So that triple was gonna fall, and given his style, it feels like Curry could play as long. Ah! Why is it? This did it to me last night. Stupid game. I've been trying. None of it worked. And now, just over a minute played here in the first. They could use a big shot here to get this offense. Yeah, that. Too many empty possessions. Right now, they need the basket. Ah, lovely. It's the third straight miss to start this game, and they're still looking for their first. Forgot what it was. Fast. And Lillard gets to a reason. Oh yeah. I Curry against Lillard, nine feet out. Oh. And oh, lovely. The lane, they Makes that come through my controller too. We that have beat. got to see that sensational mobile one block again. And early in the game, a defensive play like that goes a long way, establishing the attitude you want. Nurkic with the block. The defensive anchor. I mean, you got to uh, remember I mean, how Nurkic uses his wingspan to Oh, yeah. Shots, but... You can do that. Passes it to a reason. Back to Anthony. McCollum gets to a reason. Nurkic trying to get open. And there's a reason. That's good on the assist. Oh, uh, lovely. Ariza's got five now. And that's exactly what he's looking for. Draining the trip. Wiggins finds Green. Some nice passing by Golden State. And the Warriors oh. again. Yeah, trying to get game going here, but that's an offer. Game for the first five start the game. Not watching the line there. That That'll be a backcourt violation. I'm like flying, trying to pass it. And, and the Warriors oh. decide to take their first time out here. And timeout is the middle button. Offensively. Some bad shot selections. Well, it's some bad luck. I mean, that's not going to help you score points. No. I didn't even hit any button. If you're just tuning in, we played about two and a half minutes here in the first. And there's the pass to Chris. Here's Wiggins. Finally. That one's in his first bucket of the game. He's uh. one for two. And that ends the struggle. You can feel the tensions in the building with each miss. Well, now that they have that monkey off their back, you know, hopefully they can settle down and execute. And, contact on the and shot, to so he'll be do the three throws, you have to hit square right on the um, line thing. Right on that. Still involved with the team during that stretch and was a fixture on their bench. Yeah, shout out to my boy Nurkic, but hey, bro, you had some wild shirts on the sideline. I couldn't even watch the game. You was over there dizzying cats up, but uh, I know you were doing your thing, but he would use clothing to call out other players, teams, and commentators. Nurkic doesn't miss words, and I'm glad he's back in playing. And, and once he got to the 10, I, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. Yeah, very little resistance. So you have to bring much faster help than that. And their post play has been really solid right off the bat. Here's Looney. Oh no. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. I guess I'll need two free throws. Big in his hand white side. Looney really bounces. Releases the shot and wins a trip to the line. The Warriors shooting their first free throws of this one. And as a team, excellent. A season ago, about 80% uh -huh. when they got to the line. Zach Collins checked in for a yeah, nice The Warriors also with a sub. Pools checked in. Here's Toscano. Lays it up and banks it in. 132 left to play in the first. McCollum kicks to Little. Baseline jumper, and he gets that one to go off the front iron. And boy, did he ever sell the pump fake. Worked to absolute perfection. Collins comes over with the double team. The shot by Looney, no good. Playing him tough inside, air for the layup. Got to get the whole team pumped up. Fred passes to McCollum. Three-pointer. And the ball travels out of bounds. It was last time. I don't know what that was. Rodney Hood's checked yeah, in for the Trailblazers. No, I think here guy did. Warriors uh, also guy making a change. Smile Geach is checked in. 
There's 53 seconds left to play in the first quarter. Toscano passes to Wiggins. And there's the foul on the shot. He'll go to the line for two. And there's the call. Portland the foul. And this is encouraging. Wiggins looking committed to shooting and forcing the D to compromise. The Warriors shooting their third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. And both free throws good for Wigan. He got a bonus. Yeah. Trailblazers leading by three. Pass to Trent. Stolen away. Pool the pass to Wiggins. That one good for two. Wiggins has got by one. Eight second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Pass to Hood. For the three, oh. one up, one down, oh. two points with his first shot this game. And, and they depend on Hood to knock these shots down. He knows he's out there just to do this. With the shot, smile again, misses. Right side, this is to Collins. Three pointer on the way. Offensive rebound. The wide open shot, and it is good. The buzzer, wow! Ringing the bell, that's the way to close a quarter. And you see this so often, league-wide, ending the period. And so it's the Portland Trail Blazers. Yeah, five minutes Heading to the bench with a seven-point lead quarter. as we wrap up the quarter. They're shooting the ball so well in this one, a great performance from the field. Mm. We've got more. I didn't want to the times games where well. things are going well, so. Greg, he's certainly a gentleman in victory and defeat. You know, Lillard takes the L as a learning opportunity. Sure, it, it stings, but he also knows it can make them stronger if they use it right. And hope you've enjoyed the broadcast so far. Halfway through the first half in this one. And take a look at the Trail Blazers' performance here, boys. Uh, what do you think they're doing or not doing? Uh -oh. What we saw in that first quarter, uh, they won their matchups defensively. Yeah, they really got after it. I mean, they made life oh, extremely difficult for the shooters, which is why they hold this lead. In a moment now to reset the lineups, courtesy of Gatorade, all fueled up for the second quarter of basketball. On the court right now for the Trailblazers. Lillard and Hood work together in the backcourt. Collins is out wow. there with one side, and it's Little in at the three spot. And they'll keep possession. Now, Collins still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring yet from him. And that's going to be a turnover. They call him for eight seconds. Well, that's traumatizing. Boy, your alma mater, UNLV, Greg, has produced some great NBA players over the years. I mean, so many great names. No, no doubt about it. Listen, I, I got a special place in my heart for my former teammates, Larry Johnson and Stacey Ogman. Right. Uh, but also guys like Sean Marion. You go back to, to Reggie Theus, yeah. who was a tremendous player. And, Where and right were you now, from? You, you got Kim Birch, uh, Dump Champ, Derek Jones, and an up-and-comer in, in Christian Wood. Explain. Good mentions. And let's catch up with our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. Kevin, good evening. Well, last season, the Blazers were beset by injuries, and they fell short of their goals. Their star, Damian Lillard, said, once we're in a better position, I want people to remember how I responded when things didn't go my way. That they know my character is true. Kevin, we know that Dame grew up in Oakland, a place where overcoming adversity was ingrained. Back to you. Thank you, D.A. Count it good. Chris has got his first two points. Well, we've seen that movie a few times, haven't we? An easy bucket in the paint. And so invaluable to your offense to have somebody like Clay Thompson spacing the floor. Uh, I've, I've said it, and I keep saying it, the most underrated player in the league. Shooting 42% from beyond the arc for his career now. But what's amazing is in eight full years, he's never Ooh. shot below 40 Try to from three in one single season. And he'll lock you down on yeah, D. Work. Few Very players, well. if any, can claim that. And Portland making a change here. McCollum's checked in. It's Curry outside. No good on that one. So the Trailblazers will take it the other way. Here's Lillard. Down it goes. His third basket. He's now three for four. He's finally coming around. Trying to make up for that goose egg he put up in the first quarter. Now a timeout called by Golden State. 
and last season, Lillard doing more playmaking than prior years, a career high in assists. Mm, well, yeah. We all know that Dane can score whenever he wants to. But this team is better when he's setting others up. Lillard knows that. I expect him to continue to spread the ball around. Wiggins is checked in for the Warriors. They're scoring boatloads of buckets. It's raining buckets from inside. And Draymond Green picks up the foul. That's his first foul. And we're now a little over two and a half minutes into the second quarter. And Lillard gets it to go. Now, what more can you say about Lillard's gritty demeanor on the court? I guess contact doesn't bother. Right side, Green. Green draws the double. Rebounded by Anthony. Trailblazers leading by nine. Kicks it to Lillard. Portland moving the ball over. Collin passes to Nurkic. It's Ariza on the wing. This one for three. Portland keeps it going. A new 14-second shot clock. I said I was mad. Six on the I shot said clock. It be done. Nurkic dishes to Lillard. Kicks it out to McCollum. Gonna do it. A shot like that is a half court this game. Right way to say, hey, coach. I don't care if it cost me. Yeah, what was Tap. that? Did he forget about? Uh, very strange. His field goal the percentage has dipped this quarter. I mean, his no, movement has to be better. He has to find the open spots on the floor. It's been a really tough quarter for him. I mean, he cannot get his shots to drop. Thompson. That balls. Ice feed that time from Wiggins. Thompson's got four points this quarter. Well, Thompson makes terrific decisions. I mean, deep inside. Finds a way to play to his strengths. So timeout called here. The first for Portland. And coming into Golden State last year, Chris had a bit of a resurgence. Oh, yeah. Average more points and rebounds than any other time in his career. Excellent shot selection. I mean, he shot over 54% from the field. He's hoping he's found something that he can build on. He's hoping he's found a home. From deep. Trailblazers keep it alive. From deep three-point range. They get it back. Pass it to Trent. From deep. Don't win already. They get another chance. Little passes to Trent. From deep three-point range. Nurkic kicks the so lead. He's so good. Come on, go in. Here's Trent. All right. Here's Nurkic. Well, it was only a matter of time, but they finally get the button. Norkic has got the lead up to nine now for Portland. Curry way oh. outside. Sinks it. What range from outside. Wow. You know what? The area code just doesn't matter with this guy. Steph, Steph just dropping bombs. Here's Whiteside. And the rebound paying off as they pick up two on the there. second chance bucket right there. Yeah, coach's pet peeve there. No box out. Oh, it's simple. You fail to put a body on someone. Mm -hmm. You're finding a game. breakdown on the defensive backs. And so oh, it's yeah. Damian Lillard making things happen for Portland. He notched eight points in the quarter and has that terrific basketball uh, instinct on display. Uh, it's time now to go courtside as we send you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. David, take it away. Yes, yeah, the Mamba, the hey, Kevin, uh, Kobe Bryant thing. Coach Terry Stotts, the coach, Mamba. They've been shooting poorly. Is that good defense? Thank you, David. And we'll be back for the third quarter of action following halftime. The halftime show. The 2K Sports halftime show. Shaq. Yeah, there's. Hey again, everybody. I'm Ernie Johnson. Shaq is here. Kenny's here. You're watching the oh, NBA Shaq. halftime show on 2K Sports. The guy in the left. Oh, the black. Portland came out ready to play. They had the pieces in place for a nice stretch to open it up and went on a 7-0 run to start. And their lead was 7 when they reached the end of the first quarter. In quarter number 2, they fought off several attempted rallies and actually pulled further out in front, ending the half up by 8. Shaq, how would you think the Trailblazers were playing? It's been Dame time offensively. Leads by example and it's vocally. So skilled with the mm -hmm. ball. It's kind of mm -hmm. tough to slow down. And over to Kenny now. How'd you think the Warriors were playing? Well, they shot under 40% in the first half. Here's your deficit. They missed some open looks. Wide open. 
But overall, I thought the offense was stagnant. Look for their coach to draw up some specific plays to try to jumpstart them in the second half. And that'll about do it as we get ready for the second half. Let's take it down to Kevin Harlan. Shout out to my main man, Joel. Joel, what up? And if you're just joining us in this one, first half oh, is in the books. One half to go. One guy who's getting it done is Lillard. No problems fighting his way to the rim in this one. A lot of points in close. Yeah, slicing through the gaps in the defense. I mean, getting many of his buckets in the paint. Warriors trail by eight, setting the floor for the Warriors. Curry and Clay, the Splash Brother, in the backcourt. Andrew Wiggins is out there with Green, and it's Chris in at the five, roaming the paint. Wiggins has gone 80% from the field, 4 of 5 shooting. Now the pass to McCollum. Oh, and the rebound so goes to the Warriors. And here we go with Thompson running it up the court. Chris passed to Thompson. <laughs> She's going to go for shot. And the no. layup is good. Six points for Clay Thompson. Paint, Look, I love seeing Thompson convert through contact, muscling over whatever the D throws his way. And they pick up two. And the Trailblazers lead by six. And here's Curry who brings it up for the Golden State Warriors. And that'll be Golden State as it goes out of bounds. Warriors retain possession. Yeah, gets a finger on it, but just can't quite come up with the steal. Uh, appreciate the effort, though, making his presence felt defensively. Zach Collins checked in for Portland. Chris gets the bucket. And how about the timing on the backboards there from Chris? Has the size and quickness to be a problem. Shot by Collins, no good. That works just like they drew it up. Until the part where he short arms the layup. And it's Golden State with another. Greg, you really began to emerge and got on the national scene at UNLV, but you started your college career at Portland where you were actually named the conference freshman of the year. Uh, yeah, how about, uh, I actually averaged more points in Portland than in any season I played at Vegas. Totally different roles, but Portland's always going to have a, a sweet spot in my heart. My first child was born in the great city of Portland. Out of bounds, Portland takes possession. Rodney Hood's checked in for McCullough. Trailblazers leading by four. That's a two from Lillard. Green with the rebound. Green's got his fourth rebound in this one. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Chris has got six points. And this is where Chris does a considerable amount of damage. Feels comfortable taking those interior shots. And that one drops for him. They have ridden him today, and it has paid off in a big way. Warriors trail by four. And last year, Pascal had to do more than probably was expected of him. But this year, a much different story. Well, even in college, he played in more comfort than many of them. The stars yeah. are well, the Warriors have a lot of stars, and <laughs> Pascal is really thriving in his role. You know who this feeling and this is for, man. I mean, he's terrific at knowing when to take this. And two shots coming up at the line as he gets fouled on the shot. Yeah, yeah good job to take it right at the The Warriors shooting their fifth and sixth free throws of the game. The first free throw is good. He's already known for being a top-tier scorer. Thompson, he also defends on the perimeter at a high level. And so Thompson nails both of them. Got two points. Well, we're into the third quarter. Just over two and a half minutes played. That's a two from Lillard. Goes back up. And it's laid in by Whiteside. Whiteside's got his second best. And this has been an outstanding display on the board, and it's a big part of why they have a lead in this just game. Sta just stand there. Down low. Little, mm, he's jumped yeah. in for the Trailblazers. And so here is Golden State. Six-point game. Let's get it. No. It's offline from half court. And 
advantage the Warriors on the break. Good. Tremendous feed from Because he was wide He's open. He's about himself. He's scanning the floor, looking to create for his teammates. Portland leading by four. Three-pointer, Lillard. The offensive rebound. Right side kicks to Hood. 129 left here in the third quarter. The Warriors have gone 6 of 10 from the field in the third quarter. And Whiteside sends it back. Yeah, Whiteside will allow that. They have to work way harder than how play a block with this time. And the defense scattered all over the place on the break. Nice job finding the wide open three. Timeout called the Warriors. And a bounce back season for Whiteside. Got the minutes he wanted with Portland and showed he could still be an impact player. Yeah, sure. He showed he's still a monster when it comes to blocks and rebounds. This year will be the most telling with Whiteside. Got a new deal. I want to see if he keeps pushing himself on reverse. It's a lazy play. For the Trailblazers, Yusuf Nurkic, he's checked in for Little. And Trevor Ariza subbed in for Hood. Steph Curry's checked in for the Warriors. On the wing, Thompson to the paint. Pass goal, the pass to Curry over Lillard. Good on that shot, and with that, the Trailblazer lead is cut down now to just five on the basket from Curry. And his presence as a scorer, it, it just has a calming effect for the rest of your team. He's a fallback option whenever they need him. Oh, realizing when the defenders have overcommitted, like how Nurkic looks to hit the open man. Here's Curry with the three. Rebound by the Trailblazers. Nurkic just got rebound number 15 here tonight. But they get it back. Well, that's made a huge difference in this game, if you ask me. Their offensive rebounding has been sensational. Lillard from deep three-point land. The Trailblazers rebound. Trent passes to Lillard. Nurkic against Pascal. Now eight seconds separating the two clocks. And it's out of bounds. Last touch by Curry. Yeah, boy. Out of bounds. He has Gatorade power. Just four to shoot. Lillard from outside. Hits it from three-point range. I Lillard made that. 17. With his ability to accelerate, defenders have to be careful against Lillard. It's either give him the three or risk the blow by. Gets it to go nice. from beyond the arc. How about dueling from long range, just going at each other? Well, it's a matter of pride and a matter of each side trying to seize control of this game right now. And so it's Damian Lillard making things happen for the Portland Trailblazers. He finishes with nine points in the quarter. The D is having all sorts of problems with them. And don't go away. We'll be right back. We'll be right back after these messages. Maybe I'll finally be able to come out on top of the final quarter. Yeah, hopefully. That'd be nice. And let's take this opportunity now to show you our State Farm assist of the game. Yeah, an easy choice tonight. Look at the precision on this pass. Put it on a platter for him. Yeah, he put it on the platter, and it was served cold. Now, I love the poise, the decisiveness. This is how you run an offense. Fourth quarter of action is upon us. Thanks, as always, for joining us. Portland leading by seven. Trevor Ariza out there with Whiteside. Then there's Yusuf Nurkic. Then there's McCollum. And it's Trent in at the two. That's the group on the floor for Portland. Uh, look at the fearlessness of McCollum. Smaller guard is willing to get whacked when he's going to the rack. And McCollum on the floor, all business. Off the court, he's a very outspoken player, very colorful guy. And Greg, you were saying you, you see a future in media form when he when he stops playing. No doubt about it, Kevin. I mean, McCollum spoke up quickly about the seriousness of the virus when they were playing. He's very knowledgeable and shares what's on his mind. A media position after he's done playing is a very real possibility if he chooses to. Curry's shot is good. And they're going to have to pay closer attention to him beyond the arc. I mean, he's got two threes in this half, a total of three overall. Right side. On the arc, Trent gets the bucket, and the Trailblazers lead by seven. 
His coaches appreciate Whiteside thinking past first. I mean, they'd like to see the ball moving through him, not stop. And they found the touch from the field here in the second half. It was a struggle in that first. And so it's McCollum with it. He brings it up for the Trailblazers. They've led by as much as 10, and it's good two points. But body control from McCollum. I like whenever he works his way through the contact and finishes. Here's Wiggins, and a Another great assist by Curry one. as that one goes in. And you want him taking big shots for you oh. in big moments. That one was as easy as it gets. Coach trusts him to make winning plays down the stretch. I mean, because he's shown that ability time and time and time again. Now, here's Whiteside. Not a lot of room. Warriors trail by five. And up the court come the Warriors on the break. Smiling each misses. Oh, that almost made it in. That would be interesting. A shot like that is a polite way to say, hey, coach, bench me. Oh, yeah. yeah. What was that? Did he forget yeah, right. about uh, uh, Very strange. Points. All the officials are all over that one. <laughs> and he yeah. makes the first. The Trailblazers making a switch here. Anthony's checked in. And Golden State also making a change. Green's checked in. He hits mm -hmm. both from the strong game. This is as good as it gets from the charity strike here in the second. Mm -hmm. Elbow shot. Count the basket. McCollum's got four points in the quarter. What a dead eye McCollum is from that range. Such a tremendous feel for the mid-range jump. Uh, Here's Chris. And the layup is good. And guys, all about hard work from this point on. They've worked hard to create that high quality shot and then oh, able to knock it down. Here's Smiley Geach. He is guarded by McCollum. He gets it in there. And now just a one point trailblazer lead. It's easy to forget Curry's passing skills. He's proven he's more than a scorer, he's also a solid distributor. Leaves it is just to Nurkic. McCollum kicks to Anthony. To the wing right side. Pocket six. The 17 footer. That shot, no good. The Warriors go the other way with it. Smiley Geach passes to Chris. Golden State moving it around. To take the lead. He clangs that one off the back iron and down it falls. Wiggins has got 10 points here in the second Just by half. one, though. Power timeout called by Portland. And the lack of rim protection, top of the list. Without question. They're giving up too many high percentage looks. A trend that they'd like Maybe. to reverse. And now we present our New Balance player of the game, Andrew Wiggins. Yeah, and his percentage from the field tonight seems almost made up. I, I didn't think it was possible to have that kind of success shooting basketball. You, you need a little bit of luck, a bunch of hard work, and a whole lot of talent. On the sideline, let's catch up with Hall of Famer David Olden. Well, I was able to listen in on what Terry Stotts went over with his team. And even though they're down, he was confident. He said, look, guys, I've got all the confidence in the world in you. We've been down this road before. You know what we need to do. Kevin, let's see if they can overcome this deficit. They love the muscle Anthony brings to the three spot. Takes pride in outworking everyone oh. when he's that deep inside. The memes. I'm deep. The <laughs> long distance. <laughs> I finally got one. Now it's a four-point trailblazer lead. And that's in the gym range, Kevin. Yeah, he can pull up and I knock it down four, far anywhere. Three. They, they Here's Chris. Great D that time from Nurkic. Trailblazers have gone six of nine on their field goal attempt since the start of the fourth quarter. Anthony finds Nurkic. We've got one away left in the fourth quarter. They double him with Wiggins. Pass to a reason. The Trailblazers need to get off a shot. And there's the shot clock violation. Couldn't get the shot off in time. That one doesn't surprise me at all. So it's the Warriors now. I feeling by four. Time. It's Curry outside. Oh. It drops. 
And that shot brings them to within just one. Oh, you just love mm -hmm. seeing a player with absolutely no fear. Yeah, he approached that one with total confidence. He has what it takes to come through in the clutch. Oh, it's stolen by Curry. And here we go with Curry running it up He's the court. Walk in. It's in! Well, game is on the line. Who would you rather go to than Steph Curry? Who? This could be a turning point. Critical possession right here. Seven second difference, shot and game clock. Leaves it is just to Lillard. Pass to Carmelo. It's tipped, stolen by Thompson. Outside curve. And they commit oh, an no, intentional foul. You. That's it's another one of those so they can get like into that. the penalty. Honestly, just doing what they have to in order to get the basketball back. Trifecta! Relentless in their approach, even with the game firmly in hand. This is no let up. And, you know, this is the kind of hard nosed competitiveness that wins games. Now a timeout called by Portland. They're behind by it four. Time, it all Eight seconds left to play here in the fourth. What do you think, guys? Yeah, trying to get back in this thing, they need a score. Okay, yeah, and quick. No room for error, no time to waste. Leonard is known for being a clutch shooter. He's the guy they go to. He's the guy they believe in. Six seconds off the ball. Chris shoots over Lillard. He's off on that one. So it's a narrow victory for the Warriors, pulling out the W. They break the hearts of every fan in the building with a dramatic late victory. And, Kevin, this is the kind of win you have to take a ton of pride in. I mean, they battled with everything they had and came through when the pressure was at its highest. And now let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. Thank you, Kevin. Steph, a hot start for them offensively, but you were able to wear them down. So what changed? Just stick with the program. We try not to turn the ball over too much. Move the ball on offense and continue our defensive pressure. Hopefully, you know, we, we force them into misses eventually. Well, it worked out for you in the second half, man. Congrats on the win. Back to you, Kevin. Thank you, David. Great interview once again. Mm -hmm. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. For Greg Anthony, Chris Weber, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for watching the NBA, presented by 2K Sports. We'll see you next time. Uh, let's look at the box score. All this, all right. Let's look at the team comparison. All right. So we're going to go ahead and end this stream here. I'd like to thank everybody who came by to watch and say I hope you have a wonderful...